What's up all you scrappers? What's up YouTube? Uh, I'm not happy. Uh, why am I not happy? Is it because of the old scrap vehicle here having a, a low tire? No. Uh, that is not the problem. Problem is I started this scrap video the other day because the old 4Runner is jam-packed full. Ready to go to the scrap yard. In fact, I've got so much I, I can't even fit it all in. So I came out the other day to start it up and, and took it to the scrap yard and wouldn't start. Of course. Uh, need a little jump. I was trying to turn. Need a little jump, I thought. So hooked it up and uh, tried to start it up. Didn't do anything. I think I got a clip of it. So tried to start it up and I can see this dude's vibrating right through the crack. And uh, someone has broke onto property, uh, broke into the forerunner and stolen literally cut out uh, the air filter I, I kid you not i mean they, they literally came and cut out this part this is the only part that they cut out you know i've got junk laying around out here uh they, they didn't mess with anything there, there's tools but they took the air filter and whatever this aluminum box was that, that was on top of the air filter and I, I found the part i think on a couple spots on ebay uh, for the police report but um yeah that's the deal not happy uh, I'm not going to focus on that. I'm going to try to stay positive. Uh, you know, things could always be worse. They could have come on property and done a lot worse things. You know, so, uh, that's you know, that, that's kind of crushing though. And, and the bigger deal is, you know, now what am I going to do with this thing? You know, at least it was running before. You know, so now I got to track down apparently a part that's hard to get. Otherwise, you know, why would they cut it out? You got to track that thing down, figure out how to get it in, pay for a tow, get moved somewhere. You know, something. I don't know. So that could be the end of the old 4Runner. Not sure. The uh, bigger issue is I've got plenty of scrap. So I gotta get the scrap out of this, put in a Jeep, and it's probably not gonna be as big of a load, um, but we're gonna just go take some shred here. Uh, take some light iron to the pile, see if we can get a couple bucks. Let's do it. All right, uh, I gotta see how much of this I can fit into this. All right, we made it to the yard. Actually, uh, that didn't take me near as long as I thought to put quite a bit here in the Jeep. So we're going on to the scales right now, all kind of same day here, back to back to back to back. Uh, see what we weigh in at. All right, I never know their policy when it comes to uh, video, so I always don't do it on the scales. Uh, I do like the yard out here. It's big, it's clean. I don't like taking my Jeep regardless, you know, when you back up out here, but uh, that's what we're gonna do today. I don't even know what the current rate is. It was just time to haul it in, so. Let's see if we see anything cool in the pile. Back it up. Out here, so we're gonna unload quick. You can see, they're working pretty hard out here. Uh, you know, what I really enjoy and love is that you know, all this stuff is kept out of a landfill and uh, you know it's gonna get reused. And there we go, all cleaned out. Now we're heading back to the scale, find out what the damage was. All right, that went well, uh, went good for me. How much did I make? That's what everybody wants to know in the golden ticket, probably. Uh, all I'm going to tell you right now is I made at least 20 cents. That was the change that came with it. Um, I actually saw something down the road. We're going to go garbage pick for a minute and uh, see if we see anything. And then when I get home, we'll take a look at uh, how much room I made in the 4Runner and plus, you know, what I made on the day. All right, so I think I may have saw something sitting out here. Is this something or is this nothing? table let's check it out real quick i've actually got a roman cell coming up so you never know take a little uh end table it's wood real wood it's in decent shape i don't want to throw that in the car it's empty why not made it back to the house here had a better chance to look at this you know it's not as nice as i thought it was at first um, I normally don't pick up furniture. I'm not really, I don't do that um, too often unless it's 
you know, something that I know is uh, vintage, antique, really good shape, really unique. Maybe you would make a good project, something like that. Um, this one I picked up. I thought it was real wood. I really don't think it is. I think it's uh, pressed wood, but it's all right. Got a Roman shelf coming up, um, which is where I was going to try to sell it for, you know, maybe get a five bucks out of that. So a little bonus on the day. Uh, the Forerunner, we did okay um, getting stuff out of there because I've got really nothing left in there except for uh, the shell of a dishwasher, uh, which jam jam packed full, you know, smalls, little random metal pieces, things like that. Um, but of course it's it's crushing the fact that it's it's been broke into and now I'm gonna have to deal with it or, or <laughs> you know, it's not running. Uh, that's a step backwards and the, this whole time the, the, the goal's been steps forward. So, um, but it all worked out. Like I said, uh, things could always be worse, worst problems in the world. Gonna go back to our scrap metal. Where did we end up? What did we end up with? Uh, was it a good day? I'm gonna call it a good day. $25.20, uh, again, nothing but shred or light iron, sheet iron, whatever you want to call it. Um, I had 560 pounds, which, uh, you know, for me, small time scrapper, that that's quite a bit. I had quite a bit built up. It was time. Uh, $90 a ton, which is, what, about four and a half cents a pound. So there we go. $25.20. 20 cents. Maybe get five bucks out of this. <laughs> that's how we're going to end it. Appreciate you watching. Uh, thanks for going to the scrapyard. If you have any thoughts, questions, comments, leave them below. Otherwise, please like, comment, subscribe, all that cool stuff. As always, thanks for watching. Happy scrapping. Thank you. Thank you very much.